I think he can keep an eye out. Uh, just hurry. <sighs> it's a horrible idea, but very well, sister. Sakari, if anything, if anything comes out the water, make sure you protect Trislin and get out of here. He nods. And Rain will go and fetch everyone at the fastest speed he can. All right, maximum speed. So make, make 19 reflex saves. saves. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Clank, 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 clank through the difficult I'm terrain. only wearing a chain shirt. It's fine. The shield, the shield is slapping. Or yeah. a Russell. I, I, I doubt I'll be sprinting with a shield. That'd be fun. Uh, Tristan looks at Sakari. Do you think we should stay this close to the water? <laughs> He's still peering out in the water and then he shakes his head. No. Jesus, <laughs> why? No. It's all wrong. Then I think we should step back a little. Seems to mumble things to himself as he steps back. Still well, you, you can keep an eye out. Seems to be like that is what he's doing, yes. The Adventures of Tristan and Sakari. <laughs> Might be candy in those mushrooms. Oh my god! <laughs> Shouldn't have said that. Just rampaging through. All right. We come back. Deforestation is hit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or, I, you know. I, I don't know how Tristan Trist isn't dead yet if she's been eating everything. Yeah, exactly. Mushroom. I was going to say. I want to try this one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. The mushroom, of course. Maple, maple Maybe syrup, syrup really. <laughs> syrup really is like the the anti the, you know, anti mushroom poison. It's kind of like Alice in Wonder Wonderland. Maybe she will grow. Maybe. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't think it's kind of like out. I, I suppose it is actually, considering how this is completely an alien environment. So yeah, sure. You totally tumble down a, giant... a rabbit hole. <laughs> is a there a giant cat on a mushroom? Is there a giant caterpillar? Sure. On the mushroom. He's smoking. Oh, oh, is he smoking? Um, he's also... Uh, yes. He's, he's also declaring poems. <laughs> declaring poems. Smoking. That's what happens when you get too close to the water. <laughs> heard that. It's a fantastic world now. Uh, well, uh, Rain, after uh, a while searching around and a while sprinting, he does come upon one of the members. Uh, he comes upon Sin. In. <laughs> yes. Sakari. Uh, Sakari found. found a dock built by the gnomes. It's very, very old. And considering you ran to me, the dock is attacking you or something. Not. What, what's wrong? Not quite. So Sakari says he can see something out out in the water. Though it's our best shot we've got at finding a way across. Something in the water, I see. Well, the dog is certainly something we've been looking for, so we might as well find the others and check what it's all about. If you if you find the others, I'll return to her to make sure nothing happens. Well, he doesn't know where it is, so... Yeah, That's true. then doesn't know. Fine, tag team. <laughs> so I guess we look for the others. Yep. Tag team? Huh. Is yep. a professional wrestling match or what? Oh, yeah. <laughs> they, they give a high five. <laughs> and suddenly, Hulk Hogan runs into the ring. I imagine Sin just like, duck! And all of a sudden, all of a sudden just like a branch goes towards Sin. Oh, yeah, brother. Uh, um, <laughs> I'm sad you removed the duck. Don't, don't ever do that again, Jonas. Oh, but... <laughs> do what? I, I are the sad... I'm being spurned by the American. The only one who would understand my love for wrestling. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, you do come upon the rest of the party after uh, basically an hour of searching around. An hour? Yes. It's fine, you have Sakari to keep you company. Well, Tristan will build a sand castle. <laughs> <laughs> that is sand. definitely the appropriate thing to do. So, Sakari is sitting like watching this sand castle being built and like his, his like one paw over his eyes, like oh. How did my around. soul get bound to such a person? <laughs> he loves me. Of course he does. He will also uh, nod and say, uh, you know, appreciative words if Tristan asks how it's looking. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. He, kn he knows his job. <laughs> of course he does. 
All right. Uh, yeah. Uh, rain and sin comes upon the rest of the party. Elinary will, when told what's going on, immediately question why, why they would ever leave someone to to sit there and. Uh, I mean, why not bring Trith with them? And then shrugs and points at Rain. What was the What was the point in leaving her there? To guard the bridge, make sure <laughs> that no one came and took it. Relative would have mustered up acidic words, but you know what? Elinary spoke perfectly. <laughs> this is a rare occasion. <laughs> He'll, he'll just sit there, stone mask, frowning in disapproval. And she will say that it would be a bother if uh, if uh, she would lose her one of her siblings to a uh, bridge. <laughs> she uh, then begins, uh, that is not a fitting end for one of Theria. She will then uh, you know, set the lizard to go in the direction rain points out. Surely the deep uh, gnomes will rise from the deep waters of the lake and storm it, and we only have a limited time, and that is why Trislin must stay there. She'll not really reply. <laughs> <laughs> the, uh, the lizard throws up and then starts moving south. She's in a good mood, but she knows what happens when she's not around to make decisions. Mm. She doesn't blame anyone. <laughs> They're not big for this. <laughs> this just happens. It's just the way the world works. After, after, stuff. after over a hundred years, it's kind of like, oh my god. It's just, I have to be there. No. no she's accepted the burden. Being queen of the Az Azathir. Wow. Then sees water. Hooray. Then uh, Rayan will probably start like describe, you know, basically saying everything he could. He basically thought up about this bridge, you know, the, the architecture, how old it would be, and probably the fact it's you know linking to the island. Then we'll point out that, that it's not a bridge because it ends. A, a dock, I mean, you know, <laughs> the, fact, the fact it was, you know, probably used to link to the island before. Semantics. I was told this was a bridge to leading to the island, and. Obviously, say... it suddenly terminates. <laughs> I didn't say bridge. You, said you know, the deep gnomes might be might have been very bad at building bridges. Come on and look at it. Does there seem to be any way to look into the water, sort of see if there's anything down there? I, I mean, you can go to the beach and take a peek. You can go out on the dock and take a peek. All right. You need to certainly be closer to the water to look. Uh, ask Zin to go take a peek. Well, Zin will suddenly go onto the bridge and. Well, in there has never look really been into the water. Merged in so much water. She doesn't like. I mean, song. clearly this bridge is a good idea to stand on right now, since she we aren't on, on the counter bridge. map at all and stuff. Yeah, there is. There's like old, like debris and like. Here does make a catch-all perception check for you, Jonas, in case anything comes up. Mm-hmm. I'm not looking into the water. I'm looking at the bridge and watching my full brothers walk across it. Your, rain, well. your rain's been gone for a while. Can you like have him make another check? To have a look. <laughs> <laughs> check. I mean, you know, he the, 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 the perception he checks are really for like noticing traps, not like <laughs> like you can constantly reroll. It's like I'm just gonna keep staring at it hard enough. <laughs> you don't really. From where you are, you you can't really see much uh, sin. Is that a 10? That is a 10, yes. Mm. Goodness me. That's my natural one. Well, is that a 10? Uh, let's see here. But you know, that was rolled on the beach, so clearly I should <laughs> do another one. <laughs> yes, clearly. Well, there just wants to know if there's like a broken boat here or something. If this was abandoned or if they sort of just sailed to the island and never returned. Um, I mean, looking... Peering down into the water, Sin does think he noticed something under the, under it. I mean, it's very it's dark, of course, and it's hard to see down there. Uh, but it seems that is actually something beneath the water. Is it smoke? <laughs> what? That, that's on the water. Oh. <laughs> is it a whale? A bear? It's like a tip of a boat. I guess then we'll move closer and 
Uh, stop. Stop. Okay, that's never a good thing to hear. Brilliant. Uh, Rillard notices that uh, something is moving uh, up the <coughs> side dock here. It didn't see it at first. It seems to be a almost like a, a collection of like muck and goo sort of forming. Uh, he thought it was a part of the water first, but now it is clearly not because it is climbing up the dock. And in, in that case, I suppose an immediate action sort of thing. I think the best argument he can make, especially since his damn fool siblings can never see anything, is to cast grease right on that. <laughs> that, that, that sort of like pouring right off the pier onto this. Okay. Oh, let's take a look here. Hell if I know whether it can fall prone and have to make acrobatics checks or never move, but it's in... I'm pretty sure it can't. Uh... Like here, like, really need to, like, beware, and then, like, some weird magical word. Yeah. A what? Yeah. <laughs> excuse, excuse me? I, I'm not familiar with that sort of... What, what, what was that? What, what language is that? Yeah. You yeah, know, I, I think Rillin is intelligent enough to realize that uh, his, you know, his, his siblings might not be the, the most sort of clever at spotting things, particularly since it's creeping behind them. So the best way is to just sort of paint a square, a 10 by 10 <laughs> square, to identify the trouble spot. And maybe, sure. you know, whether, you know, it falls or whatever, it's definitely coated in a substance that is not of it. Might ruin a kind of camouflage. Yeah, uh, it is uh, when when the substance hits uh, the thing, it starts to hiss, as if like basically throwing water on a on a hot stove. Like it's like almost mist start coming off it, and the water sort of bubbles. Uh, well, not the water, but the the grease sort of bubbles in contact with uh, with this gray ooze that is uh, lumping itself out on a dock. So I would assume Zen and Rain at this point well, might see Gre it. Grease is definitely verbal, so you yeah, all yeah. certainly heard the, yeah. the, the yeah. hiss of magical words being spit out behind you. <laughs> Wouldn't it be a good time for dungeoneering checks? <laughs> it would be a good time for initiative. <laughs> yeah, initiative as well would be quite like, useful. But. Let's see how quickly we react, right? That's right. Something I can, I can only do so much for you kids, come on. There we go with a decent roll. Well, I got a one last time, so... Well done, Sakari. <laughs> Alright. Uh, rain is the first act. I have a minor question. Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> what? Uh, yes, let's see. That is a, well, a seemingly mundane puddle. Um, but uh, now, you know, being coated like it is and smoking as it is and moving as it is, uh, Rain does uh, realize that this is a gray ooze. A, um, uh, basically, they are quite nasty. Um, it does know that, first of all, they are quite difficult to hurt. Uh, being oozes, you know, they, uh, they don't usually take too much uh, damage um, when hacked at and such. He does also know that the ooze's touch deals uh, acid damage to any wooden or metal objects it comes into contact with. Okay, then. Slashing at it with a sword, for instance, would uh, very well uh, damage the sword. What okay. about teeth and horn? Uh, natural weapons are... Um, they're, not, they're not stone or... No, they are. Uh, they don't like. They are not destroyed. But striking at with a, with a natural weapon would uh, suffer. You know, make you suffer acid damage, basically. So, uh, what's the best type of damage to use on an ooze? Well, um, I have all kinds. <laughs> <laughs> he does. He does know that they are basically immune to any coal or fire damage. Is that? Is that like? Yeah, piercing, bludgeoning, or anything like that is especially good. Uh, bludgeoning can certainly work. Very well. Um, so in that case, this will be fun. I shall um, draw. Uh, I shall draw my lead-lined warhammer. Mm -hmm. 
Um, and then I and then I bought something which is very useful. <laughs> is Blade the guard. Launcher? There we awesome. go. Applied uh-huh. to any weapon uh-huh. as a standard action, prevents it from prevents it for 24 hours from being melted. I that guard my bludgeoning weapon with blade guard. <laughs> what, what is that cover it? Hey. Yeah, cover the, the hammer tip, I mean... Yep, that's fine. I understood, I, thought... I just thought it was amusing that blade guard would be used on a bludgeoning weapon. Unfortunately, I do not have enough action to put up my shield as well, so... <laughs> well... He will know what... To do, even though it's gonna hurt. There's <laughs> unpleasant thing. Bite the acid. He like, oh. oh I don't know. Be scared. The oh, no. color's not scared. I don't think you can pounce though. No. <laughs> no. That was not a straight line. Nope. <laughs> that is very true. Like jump over the water. He could technically make an acrobatic check to jump, but he can. He can still attack. It's 40 foot move speed. Oh, it's 40 foot, yes, of yeah. course. Uh, so far, Gore has been the one that hits the most, so. I think they have the same chance for point stands. Well, let's try. This is very easy to hit. You might want to power, power attack. That's a hit. That's a hit. What? Yeah. It's 5 AC. Oh, power. I should have used power attack. You're right. This I is a power it. attack target. I, if I ever have saw a uh, one. Make a reflex save. Uh, yes. Gore, backflip. <laughs> oh boy! Yeah, what are we gonna do? We can't do. Uh, 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 uh. uh takes uh half of five, so that's two damage, two. I guess. Yeah, because we always round down. Yep, two always damage. remember. Always. Mhm. Mhm. Mm-hmm. It's uh Aluminari. As uh, Sakari howls in anger as the acid bites into him. Not really sure what she wants to do here. <laughs> it's kind of not of a thing that she... Uh, <laughs> she this is not really... <laughs> would it even, like... Yeah, she could, she could channel it, but there's only, like, one of them. It doesn't really seem like that's... And is it, like, susceptible to a negative energy? She doesn't know. Well, research... <laughs> There is a yeah. way to find out, of course. Yeah. Uh, That's right. Learn firsthand, firsthand experience right now. And she doesn't really want to get too close. Uh, how far is she from everything? Oh, no, that's fine. Feet. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine then. Uh, she'll spend a channeling attempt to see if it's susceptible to that. You can spare one regardless. One point of negative energy damage. Cause it to so- to- cause it take a free five at step. <laughs> exactly. Like teleport. Uh, the uh, the damage hits it, but it doesn't seem to really be affected by whatever you know horrors she is trying to visit upon it. Sure. <laughs> the ooze does- cares not for you. <laughs> <laughs> the art. No. It is uh, it is mindless. It is completely right, right. immune to the glorious culture of Drow. Huh? To days, <laughs> not a lot of things have him days immunity. Go yeah, ooze. They know ooze power. <laughs> ooze power. Zin. Oh, let's see if Zin knows anything about this thing. Well, more or less. Doesn't really matter. I think. I just want to see if he. Knew something because then is prepared. He has blunt arrows, so he will oh, use those. Well, <laughs> there you go. Yes, he's prepared. Lovely, I like yeah, it. The martial fighters brought an arsenal. Uh, let's see here. I'm rather chuffed uh, make, by all this. Make me a perception check. A perception check, sure. Mm-hmm. Twenty-three. He notices that the puddle behind him has moved. <laughs> oh, well, that, that's not a good thing. <laughs> I, I figured we weren't alone. Yeah, uh, five foot step here, and then we'll attack the puddle behind him because it's closer. Hey, Rain- this is the alert me, the puddle behind me. <laughs> yeah, Rain- Rain Kalar is going to be like, the fuck? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, something else needs my warhammer. Those are horrible damage rolls. Oh, no, they're hits. not. Four and three. Well, yeah. 
It's a good thing it's the very, ooze isn't very kind of hard this, like, to You can't right? miss an ooze. <laughs> and yes, that is bludgeoning damage. Oh my. Oh, the oh goodness. Goodness indeed, sir, I tell I'll you. Probably count, uh, count that ammunition for 100% chance of being lost. Oh yeah, it's just <laughs> yeah. this sort of thing. And uh, I mean, it certainly s strikes uh, strikes the ooze and doesn't damage, that is clear. Uh, but yeah, I mean, they dissolve the second after. But big sort of goops and uh, like chunks of ooze fly away and sort of enter the water and seem to disappear. Okay, you're multiplying them. <laughs> we can rebuild them. We have the technology. <laughs> yep. I was going to say the ooze is going to charge, but really, I don't think an ooze can charge. <laughs> <laughs> How does an ooze charge? Seriously. I mean, does there say something in the rules that they can't be charged? I know they can't be tripped. <laughs> That's true. Ah, uh, he's going he's gonna to slam at Sakar here. No, he's not. Blub, blub. Uh, let's see here. Blub, 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 blub. I haven't actually used a gray ooze before. <laughs> mm hmm. Definitely a miss. Mm. Right, right. Yeah, yeah, he misses. <laughs> really? Yeah, many oozes. That, you, you, that's what you were checking? Yeah, I was checking if he actually has, you know, basically a splash damage or something around him. You should splash attack. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> Super effective. Oh my goodness. Let's see here. Well, just never super effective. Well, Le learn your lore, Jonas. Oh. Let's go ahead and. Uh, well, Sakari's gonna use his power attack very soon. I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, hyper beam. We'll, we'll, we'll creep use up. Hyper uh, beam. We'll, we'll creep up uh, to. Not to there. We'll save it there. That makes sense. And uh, this is still uh, a range increment, but he's going to go ahead and shoot at the gray ooze on the other side of the uh, the the dock, the pier. Mm -hmm. Does Maybe... he have blunt arrows? No. <laughs> All right. He has bolts of boltery. Mm. And I don't even really oh, care bolt. about using a free action to use knowledge dungeoneering. His eyes, his brand. Let's go ahead and select gray ooze one. Is Sakari's attacks uh, piercing or I mean, it's, uh, A bite is everything, I believe. A bite is all of them. Yeah. Uh, what is a gore? A gore is... I'm you sure. use your horns to I sort of rip gore it. Was piercing? Piercing and slashing, probably. I guess so, yeah. Let's see. That's uh, good to know. Uh, um, that is a yeah, hit. Piercing, uh, piercing. Although the ooze does not really seem to be hurt by the arrow. It's just... It's not like oozes have anatomies anyway, so it's oh, not that's like true. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not like fucking Brodart Quink making up bullshit. I just shot the damn thing. We need, we need Brodart Quink down here. I need to boo here. Uh, that, that, that goes ahead and takes care of my turn. Oh, Trislin. Uh, Sand Castle. Yeah, isn't it pretty? It is. Sakari still nods at this. Mm, very mm, pretty. Mm, yes. Uh, she will go next to her sister and uh, duck frame. Yeah, I don't know if the acid's splashing an ooze. Well, that's not what I was going to do. I'm going to use my sling. That does blunt damage. I can right. dream, blunt Harold. Damage. I mean, you, could, all, you I... could always try acid splash. You, you don't know. Aha! That's a hit. And it's into melee. <laughs> <laughs> It, it doesn't make no difference. It's an ooze. Well, for Trislin, it does. <laughs> in her mind, in her heart. Yes. What right, grey ooze here? Shuffles forward. Bloop, 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 bloop. Find out that the whole lake is just a big ooze. <laughs> it rises up. It goes, Mama! And it will slam that uh, rain. You slam! Ooh. There's a hit. For 13 damage. So it didn't hurt armor, right? Of course it did. No. It's like a rust, rust ooze. Uh, you need to make a reflex save. Uh. You no, know, if this acid harms armor, but my acid splash does, and then... Uh, no. Yes, the, uh, the armor is struck by this. 
and the acid starts eating away at it. Don't you have your alkali acids, DDS, or alkali salt, or whatever the hell you told us you bought? Uh, alkali salt, yes. Though that... Uh, actually, yeah, they, they they technically last until used, so... There you go. Uh, I need to roll how many, how many uses it has, though, because it has 1d3, so... Two, so there's one gone. <laughs> All right. Alkali what? Alkali salts. Yeah, it's like protected oh. from the for armor. Yep. He, uh, he's uh, Rain Kalar, the ever prepared with his m mobile he, arsenal. He knew this he could is, happen. He is seriously prepared for anything if it's spores or acid. Well, mm -hmm. well, well. Now I don't have anything against oozes or. Um... I appreciate it. This is, you know, Didier sat down, looked at the list. It's like, huh? What's in the underdark? Absolutely. I, I did. I also just like, okay, alchemical items list. What here is useful for the underdark? This, this, this. this. Yeah. That's it's perfect. I love it. All right, it's rain. Okay, uh, move action, draw my shield. Actually, do I really want to? <laughs> <laughs> is that protected I mean, I... by alcohol? <laughs> it is technically. Oh, actually, that, that might be important. How many doses does that have? That's three doses. Okay. Um. Three. Few. May maybe it won't be a good idea to use your sword, though. I'm not maybe. using a sword. I'm using my warhammer. Uh, I thought you said I'll shield. draw my sword. He said he was uh, drawing shield. his shield. Oh, shield. Smack it. The lead-lined, greased-up Warhammer. Yeah, that certainly hits. I can't miss! Well, it's at a one, but... <laughs> you do not tempt the fates, my friend! <laughs> <laughs> I can't miss! One. The, the ooze leers at him. It knows. It it's leers. time, miss. His time is short. The time is, is nigh. He will power attack that son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> You son of an ooze. You son of a mama slime. Thank you, Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> you son of a bitch. The ooze looks just scandalized. Mac! Mac! Uh, so let's see, the bite is... Yeah, that's eight damage straight to gore. Did we uh, find out what that is? Piercing? Piercing. Oh, goodness. So that Stamped. doesn't really freaking matter. You, you spear the ooze I still do some. Mm, okay. Reflex! So, so we don't know how much DR the thing has, so you know, it's hard to say. No. Do you still want a reflex? Uh, yes, I want a reflex because mm -hmm. you're biting into it. No, if that is Sakari gets wounded, that gives Ellen Harry something to do. <laughs> Two acid damage. Uh, well, Rain's quite injured. <laughs> but he's far away. You can teleport! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Walk up to the ooze so that she gets missed, so she that she can Alunar. teleport. Perfect plan. That is a plan. That is a pretty good plan, actually, to get extra movement. Just and cast uh, shield of uh, faith. That's a curry. Okay. Can you use that with mage armor? Yeah. Cool. Yes. Yeah, that stacks. Active mods, then. Do, do, you, do you remember why, like, Chiron and Cash has, like, 30-plus AC these days? Or is that serious for that matter? I have 32 AC now. Yeah, there we go. That, you, that is why. You've got your mage shield armor armor bonus, and shield of faith gives a deflection faith. bonus. Yep, and then shield. <laughs> Which gives a shield yeah, and bonus. And then protection yep. from whatever. And, uh, and then, and your castle some... level is two, right? Protection from ooze. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Which is a very specialized spell. You did multiple uh, did you? Oh, okay. I'll take the castle loss. Cool. Well, Elunari multiclass uh, barbarian. Yes. Rage! 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 huge muscles. Yeah. Sin. Then, well, five of up here. I love the bludgeoning arrows. <laughs> that is great. <laughs> they have suddenly yeah. something. That's pretty damn awesome. Um, you should one, totally one. put the oozes to sleep while you're at it. <laughs> <laughs> non lethal damage. No. That, wow. Um, Still hits? Still hits? No, no. That hits? No, because... You didn't uh, factor in I, the minus four? I, I didn't factor in the minus four. How uh, do I... Oh, two twos. Great. That's right. awesome. Wow. I think that's certainly... So you, you missed the you had taken precise shot. And st <laughs> I, I missed the use twice. Yeah. How do you even... 
<laughs> yeah, you know, Zen is not quite used to those uh, blunt arrows because they are slightly heavier on the top, so of course yeah. he must. Clearly they changed all the aerodynamics, and there's actually like a gust of wind blowing across the lake, and who's really used to wind here on the ads? I, I mean, seriously, there's all yeah, sorts exactly. of phys physics reasons why you wouldn't understand, that you'd require the calculus. Well, there's a lengthy excuses going on out on the dock. Uh, 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 the sun on, was uh, in my way. eye. Wait, no. Make a perception mm -hmm. check to look into the water next to me or something? Uh, yes. Maybe that's more because... There are 12 I... oozes next to you. Ah, uh, you don't really uh, see any more oozes climbing up. You, you do notice, however, that whatever that is under the water seems to be quite big. Can't really see much now because, you know, it's kind of hectic. But that is not all of it you're seeing there. That's oh, shit. I'm pretty sure. All right, Grey was one. He has a thing, a thing or two to say about a thing or two. About the Helldog. Yeah, and the Helldog, he will slither up here. Uh, it moved. That's technically a uh, acrobatics, isn't it? <laughs> I'm not sure whether like it needs to make an acrobatic because it doesn't have anything with which to make acrobatics. No, it, it just it <laughs> slimes along. It's I'd like to see stopped. an ooze fall over. Like, if you ever look ever, at ever the seen the movie Flubber? <laughs> <laughs> They're one of the Don't animals. You bring that, that up. One of, one of the creatures that even if they aren't by by sort of written rule immune to any everything, Miss. they pretty much should be immune to everything. Because it's like a pool of liquid. Yep. Cheap, I'm you disappointed mean. you didn't say the blob. How do you even...